What's up guys? Nick here with another episode of Sunset Overdrive. Now we need to help Margaret after getting this phone. I just saw it. Alright, let's talk to Margaret. That's Margaret. She's an engineering major with like the highest GPA in the so, history of the school. But she lost her dog. Pretty much just playing Ratchet and Clank, Sensitive really Drive, nothing really new Finding going on now. You know. A long way to help new job going hey, well. Whatever gets me that propeller. I keep getting There's bit a dog by frickin' across the river that she always went mosquitoes to. Mosquitoes on how I don't even go outside. Alright, Margaret's dog Boo Boo is missing. Alright. This should be a fun mission. Attention, player. Why can I jump? You earn badges from playing with. Oh yes, yeah, teaching us about the more those. stylish you are, the more badges you will earn. When you earn enough badges, trade them in for overdrives. Overdrives give you boosts in your abilities. They're, They're awesome. awesome. You can now unlock your first overdrive. Select the empty slot to equip a new overdrive. I wish I could skip this. I already know all this. Yeah. Want to unlock more overdrives? You gotta earn some badges first. You unlock and equip overdrives in the character page. I know. Okay, game, let's go. Play how you want, and you'll get better at the things you enjoy. Nice. The dog park is over in Little Tokyo. You'll have to cross the North Bridge to get there. The bridge? No, I can just jump across on these boats. Wish there was a quicker way to get across the water. Timely. Thanks, text guy. Boats? Yikes. Yeah, Open water scares me. Grind across <laughs> water. Rim, Are we sure we're not playing like a doped out Jesus? The Bermuda Little Triangle token. is no laughing matter. Hundreds of ships lost. Thousands claimed by the sea. Not only is it a hotbed for tropical storms and magnetic anomalies, but I am pretty sure I read about alien abductions and leftover technologies from Atlantis causing ultrasonic... See, so because of that, uh... Amp we put no, on the gun, the it does a lot more damage. Story. <laughs> just call me when you find the dog. Uh oh, got a big. It's like, where am I going? And there's her dog. Bark. Uh, weird dog. Come here, Pooch. Come here, Poochie. What's your name? Boo Boo? Boo Boo! On, Boo, -boo. Margaret's looking for you. What the fucking fuck? <laughs> what the hey, fucking Sam, fuck? Did you maybe forget some of the details about Margaret's robo dog? The thing won't follow me back. He must be in some kind of recovery mode. If it doesn't recognize the voice trying to command it, it will only interact with its favorite toy, Cutie oh. Kitty. Listen, there's a toy store pretty close to you. Just try looking there for the kitty launcher, okay? Or you could just tell Margaret her dog is dead. <laughs> 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 Fine. 
That's like a Wait, bud answer. The dog is if you don't know bud, please go watch his channel. That's basically oh, no, what he would say. Just we'll just tell him the dog's dead Sorry, then. Mission oh, shit. What's next? Just check the toy store before giving up, okay? But giving up is my special move. Get the 50, dude. Oh, again. It's too hot. Nice. Made in, hey, made in Asia. The QT kitty. That's my QT kitty. Sam, and I better get my propeller. Don't worry, just bring that back to the dog. I got my pitchfork. <laughs> Looks ridiculous. That's why I like this game. It's very ridiculous and funny. And I do own it digitally, so if I ever if I ever stop playing it or get bored with it, I can just delete it off my Hard drive and then just get it back later if I want to play it again. But you know, by getting games digital is a little different these days. Because they're so heavy, some internets okay, can't dog, handle it. Something you might like. Please work, please. Bark! Yeah. You like playing fetch? You want me to throw this thing for you? Hmm. How can I make this fun for me too? How about if we make it into a yeah. kitty cotton? Okay, Sam, I got this stupid dog excited. Now how do I reboot it? Not the best news to bring to you, but Margaret has to do that here. <laughs> of course she does. Just try to get used to how he moves. You have a long trek back. Yeah. Thanks for the reminder. Go get it! So, while the dog's in recovery mode, he'll only go places he recognizes. But Margaret always walked Boo Boo over the North Bridge. <laughs> the dog's doing tricks. <laughs> One other thing. You can't use your guns. The dog will sense you as a threat and kill you. Well, at least this will all be over. Don't worry, the dog will defend you as long as you have like, the kitty well, kitty. Try him out. Be over then. It's actually pretty cool. <sighs> Hello. Good boy. Thanks, Pop. Go get it. Okay, dog. Sam says you're a killing machine. Um, Let's what? see if you can kill some OD for me. Ah, I'm not gonna lie, that was pretty cool. Let's do this, Pooch. Oh no, Pooch! One atomic dog bite coming right up. Match. I can't believe I thought I would miss guns. This is a challenge for some reason. Make this jump. Now, getting too far from Boo Boo. Okay, where did Margaret walk the dog next? Hopefully, it's a place with more things to kill it. You have to make sure to shoot it every now and then. That way, the dog will keep around. That's the one who killed Daddy and took his cutie kitty. Ah, uh, shit. Let's rock and roll, Pooch! Is that a helicopter? Huh. Go get it! Time is the best thing that could have happened. Yeah, that went too far. I 
guess not. Go get it. Good boy. Oh. Come on, you're so close. Just get back to Sasquatch. Holy shit! Hey Sam, if I die protecting a fake dog, I'm gonna be pissed. I'm not sure protecting who at this point. Keep if I die talking. protecting a fake dog, I'm so pissed. Just hurry! It's you and me, dog. Let's do this! One atomic dog fight coming right up! Very murder! Much death! There's too many OD outside. You're gonna need to clear them out before we can open the door. Bullshit. Oh, before you were fine. Boo boo. But this negotiate. Ah. Oh, dude, like, the yeah, fuck? really nice work, Sam. It's like Sam didn't do anything. Okay, we need to convince just one more person to help. Then we can start building your propeller. Yay. I have new creations. Come mm. drape yourself. I'm gonna change my hair. Just make it solid red. That works. Good as it is. Hmm. All right. Max Let's see who else we have to help. At Oxford West. If anyone can calculate a propeller for optimal lift, it's him. I think he's worried about his parents. Maybe you could go check on them. All right. I guess we have to go check on his parents. Parents live in the penthouse suite of the tallest tower. Those Fisco execs make a lot of money, you know. Well, there might be a product recall on their latest drink. I'm just saying, I'm sure that can't help the stock price. You think, right? But nobody on the outside knows yet. Most of their stockholders probably think everything is running smoothly. With perhaps the exception of Max's parents. I'm having a lot of fun with this game. I do hate the fact y'all are going to hear my controller. That's because my, my oh, microphone is very sensitive. An entire panic apartment. It just looked like my hey, normal apartment, but with boarded up windows. <laughs> There's a couple inside, coins. Panicking. Isn't there a chance Max's parents turned into OD when everybody else did? It's possible. Be careful when you open that panic room door. Fair point. That's why I'm trying to have the uh, game a little bit louder than my microphone. It's so that y'all can hear the game whenever I'm not talking. Fantastic. Yeah, I'm here at the fancy town tower. Giving me a heads up that this place was crawling with scabs. How would I know? I'm practically a shut in after hard oh, night. Although, it makes sense. Once you secure the bottom floor, you have all that living space above you. Yeah, hurts, doesn't it? That's why I like the AK for it does a good amount of damage to it. This mission isn't that bad. Basically, get a harpoon, shoot it. Grind across, go up to the next. Then 
yeah, I do realize there's another dude down there now. Where is he? There he is. Fair enough. Alrighty then. Uh oh. Dead end. What's up here? Nothing. What are you? Anyone else over here? Ammo? Anything? Uh. So let's go up there. Oh. Thanks, Gab. Your fiery, explosive ragdoll death pleased my senses. There we go. Oh, at least it's the next part. Sometimes there's two different uh, hit places. Yeah. Always make sure you look around. This but it's not a requirement in this game. You don't have to buy any weapons if you don't want to. But it's nice just to have multiple weapons. That barricade doesn't look too solid. That's scab ingenuity for you. I'm sure, I can bring it down somehow. Okay, I can hit him. There we go. Oh. Oh. Fall in water, fall in water. Oh. It's just, I like the ridiculousness of this game. That's why I wanted to do a little bit. It's, it's, I like ridiculous and fun games and some of the, a lot of funny moments. And this game is full of them. Puzzling puzzle. Hey, you're killing a lot of people. Don't worry, I won't tell. As long as you drink some overcharge. <laughs> no. Don't drink overcharge. Never ever drink overcharge. Anything? Oh, 
Masters Lesson of Americans. This is our turn. Ladies. Who the fuck is this? Time for some extreme violence. Scab rushers. Got in some new products. Buy me and we'll make a deal. Yes, yeah, so I only have this gun because of the DLC. Because it's much later until you actually get an AK 47. This is basically just a blue one. This is basically the only weapon I would use except for Dirty Harry and the shotgun. No panic room here. Just be on the taller team. Hey, I just talked to your doctor. Bad news, you're gonna die. <laughs> Unless you drink some overcharge right now. Hey, Scabs, I'm coming for you. I just love doing that. I do love the fact that I get a lot of fun this time. Okay, time to check the panic room. Please don't make me find some weird sex stuff. They seem to be weird sex stuff. Voice recorder. Max's parents' dying words? Let's find out. Security breached. Oh, shit. Monday. Get all the loot. Gotta listen to that voice recording before I head back. Max needs to know what happened to his. Found it! Max, if you're hearing this message, then it means yeah. you're still alive. Shame. Your mother and I are going to live in the Bahamas. We're cashing out your trust fund so mommy can drink a lot of champagne and daddy doesn't have to get a new job. Anyway, best of luck. By the way, have you tried drinking our new overcharged drink yet? I think you'd like it. Well, at least the dick bag left a message. Max wow. Is now poor and an orphan. We should probably just tell him his parents were skeletons in a bathtub. Just get back. We'll figure out the least wow, worst thing horrible. to tell him. His parents so, didn't Sam, like him. you're sure your friends are going to listen to you now? Sure, I'm sure. Thanks to you, they think I did all this great stuff for them. You're sort of a modern day Cyrano de Bergerac. I have no idea what that means. <laughs> well, of course I'm referencing the play, not the real Cyrano. Oh, Whatever. Hey. I'll be whoever you need me to be, as long as I get that propeller. So basically, this guy's parents <laughs> left him for dead, took what money they left for him, and let me out and I'll show you where it is. Oh, I get him out of here. So. Thanks. Here we go. Ooh, money. Thank you, sir. Look at that car. That car is yeah. Well, I just tell him his parents alive, are dead. But they're major assholes. Stole his money and left him for dead. Yeah. Hmm. I'll break the news. I just love his reaction. Yes! Freedom! Thanks, Sam. Best news ever! <laughs> <laughs> Deleted them from his phone. 
Wow. So, Sam, you expect us to believe you went out and did all this stuff by yourself? I think you had a little help. No shit. Who gives a shit what you think? You guys just sit on your asses all day while this hero goes out into the city, all to get you a bunch of useless shit so you can be happy. I don't know about you, but that inspires me. Makes me want to be a hero to this hero. I know we can do I like it. how everyone has a name Together. except for us. So they We're just call him hero or dumbass or all kinds of stuff. Uh, Sam forgot one thing. If you don't help him, I'll throw your ass out on the street to fend for yourself. I'm on board <laughs> hey, like, Alright, let's do it. Cool speech. I'm ready. I'm gonna take apart the arcade to make this propeller. Nerds. What is it? It's a 3D printer. It's gonna make you a new propeller. Oh, cool. Yeah, I know. Mm, but it needs a faster processor. Of course it does. <sighs> I'll see what I can find. All right. Thank you all for watching this episode of Sunset Overdrive. Next episode, we're going to go find that computer processor and see what what they make out of this 3D printer thing that's not really doing anything. So, thank you for watching. Catch you next time.